Professor J. Mickey Melville, Professor of Astrophysics at the University of Colorado, with a research team revealed to have discovered the oldest monument dedicated to rituals and astronomical calculations dating back possibly 7,000 years old in the Sahara Desert in southern Egypt. The monument is part of a complex that covers an area of 1.86 miles by 0.74 miles. In this complex there is a stone calendar circle, where two pairs of standing stones arranged linearly appear to identify the sunrise on the summer solstice. Located some 100 km west of Abu Simbel, Nadia Playa was during the Neolithic period, a large and important ceremonial center. This area contains numerous archaeological sites, as 12,000 years ago was a watershed. During that time the summer rains monsoon from tropical Africa moved further north, forming beaches and lakes in the area. The humidity allowed the growth of grass, shrubs and even the existence of small animals. The rain was becoming capricious and irregular periods of time, so only small cattle camps were established in the area. About 9,000 years ago, sites became larger villages and ex saharan organizing themselves deep wells for water supplies. Development was observed in pottery and dead Karaan, to raising goats and sheep. Around 7,500, the drought led to groups that previously had lived in this area back to Nutha. These groups created a complex social system, not previously seen in Egypt. These young cows slaughtered and buried in Archilla also were the creators of the stone and Ali nation's oldest known astronomical measuring instrument, the calendar circle which looks like it was used to mark the summer solstice. According to Fred Windorf, an anthropologist at that time the monsoon rains begin and it is important for livestock. The stone megaliths are aligned north-south and spaced approximately every 300. Similar alienations have been found in Western Europe. A thousand feet from these alienamientos is the calendar circle, which consists of a number of stones arranged in a circle of 13 feet in diameter. Ring around the stones are four pairs of long stones, each pair very close and only separated by a space like a window or door, which a north-south lines and the other at 70 degrees north, which seems to be consistent with the Amnesser summer solstice around 6,000 years ago. In the center of the circle's stone arrangements are seen as two lines, which has not yet determined its astronomical function. When waste pits dating around the circle, we see results that put the calendar at 6,800 BC, with only an error margin of 60. A thousand feet of the circle, there is a mound covered by stones, that contain buried inside a cow inside what looks like a bedroom. This mound has a height of 3 feet and a diameter of 27 feet. When dating pieces of wood on top of the mound gives us the date of 7400-7300, with margin of error of 270. In the area there are more mounds of stones containing remains of cows, but only the bedroom was found. The ceremonial burial of these cows may signify a likely cult of cattle, which indicates that the peoples of the Sahara expressing their religious beliefs in an organized manner. The same organization of the Megali suggests the symbolism of water soul death. You may worship the cattle to be exported to the region of the Nile in ancient Egypt, Livestock was central to their belief system and deities. The mother of the Sunday was represented as a cow, used the term bull of heaven, referring to the Sunday. Horus was represented sometimes as a bull strong and Ather or Hathor, mother of Horus, was a cow. Also in the Old Kingdom, Minutes, the god of rain was associated with a white bull. 